good morning and welcome back. This year we are in the field for the 2021 version of Leading Edge Equipment Test Farm. Today we will be applying some urea using a John Deere F4365 with a dry spinner box. And later we'll be coming across the field using a 9620R wheeled articulated tractor with a 2680H. So let's get busy in the field and uh, see what we can get done today. So as we watch the F4365 go across the field with superior ride quality, this equipment is equipped with the latest technology with section control on the dry spinner box, a 4600 in the cab, and simplicity. The F4365 lets us apply the fertilizer at rates of up to 20 to 25 miles per hour. Its ability to fit with a dry spinner spreader or an air boom or a liquid system makes it one of the most versatile machines in the industry. The dual C-channel chassis design with leaf spring suspension along with the strong frame design, it flexes and absorbs the energy when going across tough terrain. As you can see, the front and rear suspension keep the machine level and powered to the ground. It's equipped with 9.0 Final Tier 4 Powertech engine and an IVT transmission. Another nice feature about this machine is the commonality of the parts with over 50% of these parts being found on your John Deere current line sprayers as well as your 7 and 8 series tractors. So on the F4365 today we have the G5 box. This is an NL5000. NL stands for new leader. So it is a new leader box but it runs through a simulation through the Gen 4 monitor. The only thing is you have a switch box over on the right hand side to turn everything on and off. This box though allows you the capability of a 16 section section control uh, modulation, so what it is, eight, eight on each side, and the entire back assembly moves left and right in order to uh, compensate for these uh, sections. So if you want it to spit out to the right more, it moves left, so it ends on the right spreader and shoots out right, and vice versa. Then it moves in and out in order to compensate for full width or starting to come down towards your middle. So just a couple things you can think about, it's 300 cubic feet box, it has automatic uh, chain oiler and tightener, so you don't really have to worry about that part of it. Um, it's just a little bit of a beefed up version of the G4 box. So Mike, you uh, spent a little time in the cab with the F4365. Uh, can you tell our viewers a little bit about uh, some of the simplicity features? Uh, it's really great when you're driving it. Uh, there's quite a few ditches out here, the smoothness of going through them, uh, the way the section control is kicking on and off when we're turning on headlands. Really a nice feature. Smooth riding machine. We're spreading up to 17 miles an hour, doing a fantastic job. What are people going to like with that Gen 4 display? Uh, you were telling me a little bit about the visual aid of the, the section control. Yes, basically what it is, you can see your section control turning on and off. You're always in question, but you can watch it turn on and off. Uh, the simplicity of it, once it's set up and running, is very simple. Uh, just a smooth running machine. Uh, I cannot see operator fatigue in that machine. We have our fertilizer applied with the F4365. The 2680's gone over and incorporated our urea. Next step for the 2021 Leading Edge Equipment Test Farm is to come back out with our 1890 and our C650. We're gonna be seeding wheat. So stay tuned for further reports and thanks for visiting the farm today.